Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the song called Sadness and Sorrow from Naruto. Yes, this is a very, very much feels song. Okay, but anyway, here we go. I'll be teaching you the main theme of this song. Check it out. It goes like this. This is what the preview of what you're going to learn today. Check it out. like that okay the two sections here let's break it up to the two sections and also break it up to parts and learn it okay so here we go okay the first section the first part goes like this okay right hand starts on the F sharp here middle C's for reference go up an octave F sharp here it goes F sharp E down to B up to E G A down to E just like that okay so that's the first part one more time for the first part so it goes F sharp E B up to E G A E, like that for the right hand. Left hand, two chords for the first part. The two chords are E minor, which is E, G, B, followed by C major, which is C, E, G. So with these two chords in mind, so E minor followed by C major. The two hands together goes like this, F sharp and E minor together. So it's together. And the right hand, A and C major together. Just like that. One more time, so it goes like this, together. Together. Moving on to the second part, right hand continues up to G, F sharp, G, A, down to D, up to B, then A, like that for the right hand. One more time, so it goes like this, G, F sharp, G, A, D, up to B, and then A, like that for the right hand. So that's the right hand for the second part. Left hand, we have three chords here. The three chords are D major, which is D, F sharp, A, followed by G major, which is G, B, D, back to D major again. So those are the three chords. One more time, so the three chords, D major to G major and back to D major. With that in mind, the two hands together goes like this, G and D major together. Two, three, four. Together, two, three, four. Together, two, three, four. Like that. One more time, so it goes like this. Together, two, three, four. Together, two, three, four. Together, two, three, four. Just like that, okay? So that's that. Okay, moving on to the third part. The third part is very easy because the third part is exactly the same as the first part, so it just goes like this. Like that. Okay, so let's just go ahead and recap the three parts that I've learned so far, okay? So the three parts that we've learned so far back to back is play like this. Just like that, okay? Now moving on to the fourth part. Fourth part continues. Right hand, it's similar to the second part, but the right hand kind of shortens a bit. It goes G, F sharp, G, A, down to D, and end with E this time. And that's it. Okay, and that's the right hand one more time for the right hand for this fourth part. So it goes G, two, three, four. F sharp, G, A, down to D, up to E, like that. Just like that. That's the right hand for the fourth part. Left hand, we have three chords. The three, uh, no, actually two chords, my bad. So two chords are D major, which is D, F sharp, A, followed by E minor, which is E, G, B. So yeah, with those two chords in mind, so D major and E minor. Two hands together goes like this, really straightforward. G and D major together. Two, three, four. E and E minor together. Just like that. One more time. So it goes together. One, two, three, four. Like that. Okay, back to back. The whole section that we just learnt here for the four parts is played like this. Back to back. G 
just like that, okay? It's pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and move on to the next section, which is pretty awesome as well. Okay, let's break it up to four parts once again. Okay, so the first part of this second section we're learning right now, it goes like this. Right hand goes E, F sharp, G, A, B, down to E, G, F sharp, and then E, like that. That's the first part for the right hand, okay? One more time, so it goes like this. E, F sharp, G, A, B, E, G, F sharp, E, like that for the right hand. Once again, that for the right hand, the left hand, we have three chords here. The three chords are C major, which is C, E, G, followed by passing to B minor chord, which is B, D, F sharp, followed by E minor, which is E, G, and B. So with these three chords in mind, so C major followed by B minor followed by E minor. The two hands together goes like this. Right hand starts first with the first three notes and then A and C major together. After G, B minor by itself. E and E minor together. Just like that. One more time, so it goes like this. Together. Here. Together. Just like that, okay? So that's that first part, okay? Moving on to the second part of the section. Right hand continues, it goes G, A, G, F sharp up to B, B, A. Like that for the right hand. Okay, so that's right hand for the second part. One more time, so it goes G, A, G, F sharp up to B, B, then A. Like that for the right hand. Okay, so this is right hand, left hand, we have four chords here for the second part. The four chords are C major, which is C, E, G, followed by B minor, B, D, F sharp, followed by G major, which is G, B, D, followed by D major, which is D, F sharp, A. So, with these four chords in mind, so C major, B minor, G major, and D major, the two hands together, it goes like this, okay, G and C major together. After F sharp, B minor by itself. And then B and G major together. A and D major together. Just like that. One more time, so it goes like this. Together. Here. Together. And together. Just like that. Alright, moving on to the third part. The third part is played. Um, let me see. Oh, fantastic. It's actually pretty much the same as the first part, but we just don't have the lead up three notes. So we don't have the E, F sharp, G, which goes straight to the A and C major. Exactly the same thing, like this. Okay, can you see the similarities? So it's pretty much exactly the same as the first part, but the right hand just doesn't have E, F sharp, G leading to it. Okay, so remember that. So that's the third part. Let's get on. Here. Then let's get on. Okay, so I'll quickly play it back to back, the three parts that I've learned so far in this section so you understand what I just um, did, okay? So it goes like this. So yeah, moving on to the fourth and last part of this section, right hand goes like this, G, A, G, F sharp, down to B, up to E, like that. That's it. One more time, right hand, so this fourth part goes G, A, G, F sharp, down to B, up to E, like that for the right hand. Okay, that's the right hand. Left hand, the fourth part here, we have three, uh, three chords here finishing off. It's C major, C, E, G, B minor, which is B, D, F sharp, which you know, then it goes to A minor, which is A, C, E. Just like that. Okay, so three chords are C major, B minor, A minor. With that in mind, two hands together for this fourth and last part of this section goes like this G and C major together. And then B minor by itself. E and A minor together. Just like that. One more time, so it goes together. Here. Together. And that's it. Okay, so let's just recap the whole um, of this section back to back and we'll call it an end, okay? That's it, okay? So, yeah, hope you have fun learning this song. It's really 
awesome song, like brings back the feels, a lot of feels. Please don't cry when you play this song. <laughs> okay, but anyway, maybe you can make your friends cry or something. It's just bringing this song to them, okay? But anyway, have fun learning it. And also, like, if you want to make it more, like, as I said, like, more expressive, this song is expressive, just um, use the pedal. So if you don't know how to use the pedal, uh, there's, like, probably, like, um, videos online on how to do it. I teach how to do that as well, but you can check that out my, on my website. But as for now, I guess, go ahead and, um, yeah, enjoy your time on my channel. And as for now, see you next time. I'm glad you made it to the end of my video. Now you can visit my website to learn how to play this or any song you want through my methods explained through books and courses. Or just get me to make a full song video lesson or sheet music transcription on any song you want using my customized services. As for now, enjoy your time on my channel, subscribe and see you next time.